I'm really not here to waste your time. If you want to know when version Z is dropping in Global Dokkan and what's coming alongside the update, this is the video for you. I have no reason to hold anything, anything back. And I'm going to give you all the information that we have received regarding version Z and Global Dokkan, which is this, all right? In the in-game news itself, it mentioned that version Z will be dropping mid January, so the middle of January. To me, that means anywhere from the 10th of January all the way to the 20th of January. So in 10 days from now, I would expect version Z is already in the game, but we do not have a specific date just yet. But I can promise you this. The moment we have a specific date about version Z, I'm going to let you know immediately in video format to keep you updated. On like on top of that, Whenever I get confirmation about when exactly version Z will be dropping for Global Dokkan, I'm going to let you and everyone else know when version Z drops, but in every single time zone as well. That way, no matter where you are in the world, you will not miss out on version Z. So, you don't have to subscribe to the channel, but if you want to stay updated, I'd recommend keeping some tabs on the channel. But if you do you know, enjoy content like this, you might want to consider subscribing. Let's move on, though. So, when it comes to what's actually dropping for global dokkan in terms of version z or version z for global dokkan um we'll be getting a new free to play lr physical goku i'll cover him in a different video i'll mention exactly how to get him in a different video as well since i don't want to you know take your time up in, in this video so stay tuned for that type of content also there's 77 dragon stones when it comes to getting all these missions done so again i'll do a whole breakdown on this but there will be a new free to play lr goku he's actually really good so i would highly recommend watching that and getting all those missions done we will also have an, uh, an update to the hidden potential system. So currently on Global Dokkan, um, you don't have to click as many as you had to before before, but it still takes, you know, a, a few to get to go ahead and rainbow a unit. But now you just click one button and you activate every single thing you possibly can. You have to, you know, unlock dupes first before you click it that way. You know, it, it just auto autos that too. Um, but I believe that you still have to manually do all of like the additionals and crits and dodge all that good stuff which is fine to me because again it's like it's still 10 times quicker as much as it was before so i don't really mind that an active uh, uh you know an update to this i've been waiting for for a very long time so i'm very excited for that we also have um you know uh, the auto feature so basically there's auto map feature and an auto battle feature when it comes to auto map um, it's basically you know you click it and it does the map for you so you don't have to click the numbers to go through the map before you get to a fight you just do auto map and it's going to go for you i think it prioritizes the highest numbers and the easiest route so that's what i've heard but well i guess we'll have to go ahead and see and then when it comes to auto battle it just again just does the battle for you automatically so if you want to grind a dokkan event um just pick your strongest team click auto battle go do something else and it's going to go ahead and clear that mission for you or clear that event for you very very easily so again just makes grinding a little bit easier um, in terms of just not having to pay attention to the phone the whole time um so yeah we also have this right here no more team costs so please if you're on gold dokkan right now you're watching this do not buy a single piece of team cost um it's really not worth it since they're taking it away completely they're doing away with team costs there's also going to be an in, sorry there's going to be 50 teams that you can build instead of the seven or eight you can build before um, it seems like there's going to be five different pages and each page allows you to have 10 teams so again so many options for team building you can now just build your favorite teams of all different types of categories and then just pick it for whenever you're gonna you know you're actually gonna go ahead and hop to a specific event this is very very good i actually love this uh version of the update um again there's no more team cost so even if you're a new player and you awaken all your new lrs there's no limitation for what you can run on your team so again a very very good implementation in my opinion and then we also have um they're gonna make it a little bit easier to find and uh, know what units you still have to grind. Basically, the whole Giru, Giru function is just letting you know what you still have to complete in Dokkan, what missions you have to complete, what units you still have to grind, etc., etc. So it's going to be easier to find that, and it's going to look a little bit better as well. So stay tuned for that, you know, Giru little thing. Um, again, just a, a nice little update to that. And then also, I want I want you guys to know this, okay? Because I know a lot of people when they saw version Z on JP, they were very unsatisfied. Keep in mind that version Z is not you know a one-time update right it says right here the content of the version z update plan will not be limited to what we have introduced this time we will continue to develop new and better content to make dragon ball z dokkan battle easier to play please look forward to the to the introduction blah 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 blah, blah, blah. so this is whatever whatever we're receiving right now all this stuff here is not going to be it for version z version c is going to continue receiving a lot of updates i i think it's i would assume maybe three or four big 
uh, update rollout it's going to come to jp first so just stay tuned for that and i'm going to let you guys know again when it should be dropping for global dokkan so again stay tuned for all this information i'm going to let you um, this is literally the place to be if you want to know when all the stuff is dropping how to get certain things done I'm, I'm gonna let you guys know in video format so again stay tuned for that i managed to make this video under five minutes so hopefully i did not waste your time i think this is you know very information packed hopefully i'll go you know you have a great rest of your day i appreciate you guys for being here and i'll see you in the next one take care and peace